golf fans, it's January in Arizona, and you know what that means. We're only a few weeks away from the best gosh darn golf tournament in the world, the Waste Management Phoenix Open. It's breaking par, it's the Phoenix Open, you know we're gonna have some fun again. Everyone's been asking us lately, what are you guys gonna do this year? Well, first of all, I'm not sure we can top last year since we literally did top it, like over the top of it, that is. I'm professional golfer Cheyenne Woods and today we are driving the grandstands. Love it. Nice. Yeah, buddy. Not only did we have Ricky Barnes and Cheyenne Woods slam drivers over the grandstands last year, but Ricky almost hit a hole in one on 16. Uh oh. That was good. Uh oh. Wow. Uh oh. Wow. Go in. What? Go in. Did it go in? No. Almost. How close is that to the pin? It's not even a foot. It's inches. Oh. Not even a foot? That would have been. a hole in one. Oh. That would have been epic. Oh my God, about five inches. Take a look. You do this in the tournament and the place might erupt. And in golf, this is what we call kicking. Literally kick it in. All right, that's enough looking back at the past. Let's look forward. This year, we have a pretty special treat for you guys. Let's just say we're gonna keep it real this time. We teamed up with our good buddy, professional golfer and social media rock star, Paige Sporanic, to tackle a few golf shots she's always wanted to try at the Phoenix Open. Joining Paige is seven-time NFL Pro Bowler, Arizona Cardinals' Patrick Peterson, and Arizona Diamondbacks pitcher, Archie Bradley. Archie brought his beard and his Jordans. Here's the catch though, this little bundle of joy doesn't drop until February 1st, day one of the Phoenix Open. Mark your calendars, folks. These shenanigans don't go public until the Phoenix Open officially kicks off on February 1st. Ready? Mark. Hey everyone, it's Paige. I'm out here at TPC Scottsdale, one of the most famous golf holes in the world, number 16. I'm here with Archie and Patrick. You guys ready? Let's do it. Okay. That's <laughs> gotta go again. It's still freezing out here, so we're trying to warm up. Jumping jacks. There we go. Okay. Keep them going. That was golf right there. That was right. Yeah. Golf. That was golf. <laughs> this is like my childhood dream. You know what I mean? This is stuff you made up in the backyard. Let's do it. While we can't show you guys everything that went down out here quite yet, we did get a chance to download with Paige and the guys a little bit between shots. I love 16, but I think 17 is actually one of my favorite holes. It's more exciting. I watch the guys every year come out here and drive the green. If you're gonna win the tournament, this is a hole that you have to birdie or even maybe eagle. That was a good one, Paige, that was a good one. So how does it feel? I know you guys play in front of massive crowds all the time and everyone's always cheering for you. Do you get more nervous on the golf course? 100%. Yeah. It can be a group of five people standing over watching me putt or swing and I'm more yeah. nervous than playing in Dodger Stadium in the playoffs, you yeah. know? You know, it, it kind of gives you that football feel of yeah. the crowd going wild when you do something great and they booing when you do something bad. You make a bad pitch, it's like, whatever, I know I can make another good pitch, but one bad golf shot leads to another, and you know, it yeah. just, it's, it's nerve wracking. I don't know how, how you guys do it. But you guys are great golfers, so. <laughs> <laughs> My favorite memory from the Phoenix Open would probably be uh, this past year. I got to play in it for the first time. Got to have my dad as my personal caddy and uh, stepped up on the 16th hole with some of my teammates and friends and I was able to uh, stick the green. And then on the side note, walking around here, I love watching these girls try to walk around these high hills, just slipping and sliding. And uh, it's a golf tournament, you don't wear high heels. Come on, let's go, clean it up. <laughs> My favorite memory is just coming out here year after year, 
I think the first year I attended, I was either 12 or 13. I remember when I was in college, all my friends would come out and they're like, oh, we're gonna go to the waste management party. And I was like, the golf tournament? And they're like, no, the party. And I was like, it's a golf tournament. <laughs> Whether they're here just to have fun, watch golf, or just be with friends, it's, uh, it's cool that you can do that all in one golf tournament. My favorite memory about the waste management, have an opportunity to, to play in it and play with some of the pros and get to pick their brains and see how they kind of break down the golf course. and. Um, it's just remarkable to see how consistent that they are throughout the day and the attendance year in year out. It's just unbelievable. Face, oh! hey! <laughs> what do you got on that?